you to everybody so we are back again uh, with this video this is uh, chapter 6 lesson 5 uh, it's about thesuk uh, thesuk means just now that has happened that already has happened but nor not far in distant part past but it has happened just recently that is called thesuk and thesukumbar means uh, and the tense or the news uh, that has just happened uh, it is happened in the recent present so that is present perfect tense you can call it in english so in this tense the thesukumbar or uh, the present talk or the uh, present discussion or the present sentence or the tense uh, we we are again going to take the uh, example echum to do uh, so in this we are going to give you some examples ja etamba that means i have done in english you use have and has have uh, mostly for um, plurals more than one person and has for single person except for i you will use have in english and in brusaski there are different techniques to make the tense make the sentence i am going to explain you so uh, this is etamba et echum from echum etamba okay etamba i have done that means any work I have done. That means I have done a course or I have done graduation uh, so that I have done. That you will say in Brushaski Ja Etamba. Me Etaman. Okay, Etaman. We have done. Un Etumba. You have done. Okay, you have done. You understand? So, ma etuman, that is also for more than one person for plural, you have done. Here will come done. Okay, ne etumbai, he has done. Okay, he, with he, you will use the has. And mo etumbu, she has done. Okay, mo etumbu. Okay, then vi, uh, ve etuman, that means they have done okay they have done more than one person khwe etuman these have done these people have done okay so this was for the human beings uh, the next column is always for animals and uh, for non-living beings as you have understood it now you have become used to it and habitual to the brushaski grammar now because uh, this is the sixth chapter and the fifth lesson by now you must have been familiar with uh, much of the words many of the words so se means that a non-living being or an animal a singular uh, in the distant that has done se etumbi okay guse etumbi this has done se etumbien plural more than etum bien okay etum this is theta etum bien they have done okay good say etum bien this is say say for chapi etum bi bicha good say etum bien good say etum bien this is written wrongly bicha i will correct it so good say etum bien okay these have done okay te etum dua that a uh, non-living being, uh, 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 a flat object or a fluid object or something, air or wind or some natural force has done something, S suppose it has done a destruction, so you will say, te etundua, that has done, with that singular it will come has, okay, so gute etundua, this has done, the object is nearby so you will say this has done 
okay uh, now now the plurals k etumbisa the same uh, fluid soft folding objects or the flat objects have done so bicha you will use in the plural bicha this is che this is che this is che so that is these have done thank you very much and i will post a screenshot that will be visible for you in the comments uh, and thank you very much we will meet in the next video